Hey there, guys. It's Hop, Hop's Metal Signs. If I look a little bit dopey dressed today, it's balmy 41 degrees in my shop. So, I uh, thought I'd uh, shoot us a little video here of uh, my bead rolling machine. It's a commercially available $140 machine that I've made some modifications to and have made my own set of what they call art dies. And this allows us to chase a line and break and fold that piece of sheet metal uh, in a continuous point and drive this thing like a sewing machine. And what we're doing today is uh, we have a piece of artwork that a young man, customer local here sent me. I took it, scanned it, processed it through some software, and printed it onto four sheets of paper. Use commercially available uh, spray adhesive that breaks loose real easy with, say, some uh, simple solvent or uh, enamel paint thinner. So I wanted to show you this here. It is plain, good old-fashioned rusted sheet metal on the back. The front side I did sand and clean up for me. And uh, we're going to be chasing these black areas you see will be raised. Everything else will be, be lower. And then to complete it, I'll put a, ser a series of border around the outside of this panel. So here in just a moment, you're gonna, we're going to make some adjustments to the camera since it's just me out here today. And uh, we'll get this thing going. And hopefully I'll get you some good shots of uh, how this works. So here we go. We're going to move the camera and uh, stomp around a bit here. For, so hang in here with me. And we've got low camera batteries right now, which I'm rather surprised about. Uh, guys, I'm back. And uh, I think we got some adjustments made. So we're going to just start by working from the inside of the panel out. And uh, what I'd like to do is pick my first location on the metal, the touch, and then I load into the sheet, and we start driving here. And load. Now when we have corners that are a little bit with a larger radius, we can go a little bit further, and then we can actually turn on the radius. Like I said, things are cold in here today, so this is making it just a little bit fun, or different anyhow, let's put it that way. I don't know about fun at the moment. Like I say, when you got a little bit larger radius, you can actually turn on the corner. quick. Well, I don't know how well we can see this, but we're now actually moving the material around. So we're going to continue following our lines.
and we're going to continue. And uh, here in a bit, we'll reinitiate the video, and you can see what we've accomplished. I'll be right back.